sure something that happened on Friday night. We went to a Saints Parade over in Cooch at Desert Oasis Church. And everybody takes turns doing it two or three songs. Oscar Law was there. We were over there and we did a few songs and we came to sit down. And while we were on the stage, a young man came in and he sat down next to Dessa. And Dessa said, well, this is my husband's seat. So he scooted over one chair and he sat there. This fat guy, and I came in to sit down and, and he says, uh, hey, sir, he says, uh, if you have any work, I'm looking for work. He said, I, I'm a homeless and living in the car. And he said, I'm just trying to get by. And I was, I was amazed by, by him asking me that because I, I help people find work as much as I can. Somebody asked me for work, I try to find the work. And I thought, well, is it on my forehead, son? Does it radiate? <laughs> is there something that happened that in the strangest place, after in the strangest situation, somebody would ask me that question? So I talked to him and he gave me his name and his phone number and we, we sat through part of some more of the service and then we went up on the stage again and we came back and sat back down and, and he said, well, he says, uh, he says, I got to go. He said, I got to walk home. But I said, no, you sit down. The name was Jose. I said, sit down, Jose. He said, I'll take you home. He said, well, I walked all the way up here. It's a long way. He said, no, you just stay here. And I said, I'll take you home. And so what I didn't know was God was going to take him home and let him be a child of God before the night was over. At the invitation time, Jose stood up and pray to prayer and walk forward and accept Jesus Christ. Just as the young man did this morning. Those are miracles. Those are amazing things. When, when, when he's sitting there and he's praying the prayer, the Spirit of God comes over you so strong that it's hard to just sit there. It's hard to just sit there. And then he got up and walked forward and I wanted to go with him. I wanted to go pray with him, but the pastor of the church is there, and I'm, I'm holding on to my chair and saying, Lord, what do you do that to me before I can stand this? And Dustin's saying, Go! And I'm like, I can't! You know, hang on! It's amazing to be there. It's amazing to be, to be, to, to, to see God just reach down from heaven and touch someone. It's amazing. It's amazing this morning. It's amazing every single time. Never one time is it not amazing. So glorify God with your life that amazing things will happen right next to you. Right next to you. The Spirit of God is that close right there. Working in somebody. He's love. He's patient. He's kind. All the fruits of the Spirit. Right there. Right there in the chair right next to you. God is good. All the time. Anyone else this morning? Anyone at all? If you're sitting there waiting, don't wait as you are. Don't wait. There's a name written on that. I didn't even get your name, sir. I'm sorry. Peter. I knew that. I knew that. I've met you before, obviously. Peter, Peter's name is written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Amen. And the angels and saints in heaven are rejoicing today for one that accepted Jesus Christ. Never to be removed from the list, never to be taken out of his hand, nothing can remove him out of the hand of God Almighty. Amen. And my prayer is that he'll anticipate the return of Jesus as he's coming. So anyone else this morning, anyone else? I'm waiting on Miss it out. All right, let's close in a word of prayer. Lord, we thank you for today. We thank you for Peter coming up this morning. We thank you for Jose going up Friday night. Lord, we just thank you that you allow us to, to experience you in a way that the world will never understand. And Lord, we just ask that you put an anticipation in our heart to take away the waiting and let us just be anticipating all that you want. And all the glory we will see. Glory to your name. All the glory we're going to witness someday. Lord, let us anticipate. 
And let's give you thanks again for today and for everything that you've done already and all that you're going to do today. We thank you. We praise you, Lord. We lift your name on high. We look so forward to tonight as we kick off the Feast of Tabernacles. So invite everybody to come back. And we give you glory. And it all in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.